Welcome to our tutorial on editing your macro. First, let's insert two text box controls. The first box will be TXT Radius. The second will be TXT Depth. Let's scroll down to the value property and enter Depth parenthesis, millimeters, close parenthesis. We're going to do the same for the first text box, radius, and in the unit of millimeters. Hit your tab key to register. Now let's delete this code here. Now I want to declare the variable r as a double. Tab. Let's right click and copy this line. Down to the next line, right click and paste. Let's declare depth as a double as well. Now we'll declare the value as a variable DBLR. This function converts a string into a double. Copy and paste. Now we'll do depth. And we're halfway done. Let's enter the rest of the code. Right click, cut, back to the form, and paste. Now we need to replace our argument literals with variables. Right click, copy, scroll down, right click and paste. Same for the radius variable, right click, copy. Here's the create closed circle function. Here are our arguments. Right click and paste. Now everything should be fine. Let's check our program out. See how it works. We'll enter a radius value of 50 millimeters. For the depth, let's say 35 millimeters. And we'll click compute. Here is our circle. Let's close our program and enhance the code a little bit more. We're going to call our user form dot show. This command lets me call my form from this module. Let's test to see how it works. Tools. Macro, Macros. Let's run Module 2. Here's our form. For the radius value, let's enter 10 with a depth of 55 millimeters. Compute. And here is body number 4. And our cylinder. And this concludes our tutorial on editing a macro.